Denmark has defended its decision to tighten border controls, insisting this won't contravene EU rules on the freedom of movement. So this is to ensure that the darker sides of the very positive uh, free movement uh, do not strike so hard as they do, that we can try to get to uh, trafficking to people who uh, uh, smuggle drugs and so on, but while we keep the positive aspects of free movement. Critics, though, see any softening of Schengen by way of stricter border checks as an attack on one of the key achievements of European integration. Copenhagen maintains it is sticking to Schengen's principles. People can move from A to B within Europe without being hindered. Uh, the other day I was myself in London, uh, which are outside that part of the Schengen Agreement, and I was waiting for one and a half hour in, 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 in the airport. I mean, we don't want to go back to those aspects. Our correspondent in Brussels says a lot of member states seem to want a watered-down version of Schengen. The Commission should be able to avoid the worst, but how? That remains to be seen. We'll probably find out at the next European summit in June. Sergio Cantone, Euronews, Bruxelles.